Good morning everyone! Ring Fit is a relatively expensive piece of kit, and as with all equipment, it is best to take care of it as much as possible. So this is a handy little guide on how to take care of the ring con, the thigh strap, and keep them in as good a condition both mechanically and hygienically as possible. Number 1. Warm up the ring. So it sounds silly, but it's a flexible piece of hard plastic, so I like to give the ring con a little warm up, literally pushing in and pulling out 5 times gently before use. Much like our muscles, it does start out cold, and the tension makes it more flexible. It might just be a little tick for me, but I find it feels better once it has been like warmed up a little bit. Number 2. Pull out. All good healing aside, most of the time during play you'll be pushing the ring con in to perform exercises. The variety of presses are vast and the opportunities for pulling the ring con out are not so numerous. So it makes sense that it can become imbalanced and I've seen a lot of pictures from people who now have egg shaped ring cons where they've pushed it in a lot and it's warped to the ring con. Now the game isn't called Egg Fit Adventure so we want to balance this out by pulling out on the ring con a few times as well in order to help maintain the correct shape of the ring con for longer. Number three, washing the fabric. Now, as with our clothing, sweat and dirt can build up on fabric parts of the ring con and the thigh strap, so we want to make sure we're cleaning it. Undo the Velcro straps of the ring con hand pieces and hand wash with a neutral detergent along with the thigh strap. Then air dry them. The Nintendo America website states that you shouldn't place the hand grips in direct sunlight, and I'm wondering if this is due to the Velcro, but you know, still, in a well ventilated area, it'll dry well and you shouldn't have any issues. And number four, wipe down the ring con. After play sessions, and especially when you have the hand grips off, I suggest wiping down the ring con with a damp cloth and then leaving it to dry in a well ventilated area. Sweat and grime can accumulate on the plastic as well, and it can become a breeding ground for bacteria, not unlike weights in the gym. There's a reason why you should wipe down your equipment when you're done, and this is no exception. And store safely. You don't want to damage the ring con outside of use, so storing it in a safe place is great. I have a dedicated area for leaving my ring con and thigh strap, and some retailers in the US actually have ring con holders you can buy and mount for safe dedicated storage. I really wish they were available here in Australia, but as long as you have somewhere safe and out of the way to place it, that's what you want. Nothing worse than it being left somewhere and something unexpected happens and damages it. Cool, so that's my little tips guide on how to take care of the ring in both a hygiene sense and a mechanical sense. There's nothing revolutionary here, but as I said earlier, you want to take care of your equipment, you do not want to have to replace the ring con or thigh strap in general, but it would especially suck if it's something that you could have prevented. Thanks for your time today, make sure you like and subscribe for more ring fit content, I'll see you soon.